We've had the workshop. We had nearly 200 stakeholders attending. We've had some very interesting feedback on the intermediate CONOPS and it's clear that a European drone operator should be able to operate in other parts of the world, particularly the USA, without too much difficulty. So first of all, in the value of the CONOPS is that given this emergent market, uh, the key role that we as government agencies have when it comes to Eurocontrol or NASA or FAA in the United States is being acting as enablers of this market. And in that sense, we need to make sure that we're the driving forces to make sure that this emergent market is enabled in a safe and efficient manner. And we establish the right processes, procedures, regulations, and, uh, and operational concepts to make sure that they're able to operate safely within this, par within this new paradigm. Uh, in terms of drones and urban air mobility, uh, this is the future of the, of the national airspace. This definitely for us, at least on the United States, we view it as the most exciting time to live since uh, the Wright brothers uh, when it came, comes to aviation. Uh, in terms of aviation, we had the Wright brothers, we had the jet age, and now we have this new emergent market paradigm. Uh, and in terms of uh, the roles and responsibilities between NASA and FAA uh, and, and here in Europe, we have, first we have different operational paradigms. Uh, we operate our airspace differently both based on our cultures uh, as well as the needs of our societies. We have different needs uh, and the way we do things. So in that sense, it's really important to make sure that first we try to harmonize uh, our concepts as much as possible uh, because these vehicles and manufacturers are not going to each stay on each side of the ocean. Uh, whatever vehicles they build, they need to be able to operate globally. Uh, likewise, because of the operational differences between us, we also learn each from different things of doing things differently from each other as well. Uh, there's positives uh, on both sides. Uh, so exchanging that information is key to making sure that essentially we, we're able to collaborate and learn from each other. And it's almost like uh, the collaborative result is, is net positive. It's almost like doing a two plus two equal five. Uh, where each one of us bring in, brings in two um, units of research and knowledge and then together we're actually winding up more than what we would have had alone. We're now working on the final version of the CONOPS using the feedback that we received in the Rome workshop. Our aim is to release the CONOPS at the end of September and there will be a dissemination event in Brussels on the 30th.